2,000 years after the departure of Jesus the Christ. The prophets are back to teach the real Jews, the 12 tribes of Israel, their true nationality. This is their campaign. Start to live with men and all these things because these are the things that catch them. 
You understand? A man just rolled out his tape. He thought it was a woman, but it was a nigga. Come on, read. Teaching us that the night ungodliness and rightly lust, we should live soberly. 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 That's how we're supposed to live. Soberly. We should live soberly. We should live soberly. That's what God said. You know how you live soberly? Keeping the law. Keeping the law. You understand? These are the things we're supposed to do. Come on. Righteously. Righteously. You understand? These are the things we're supposed to know. When we go in front of the pastors and the church, he's supposed to tell us how to live righteously. You understand? Listen how to live righteously. Corinthians 6 and 9. These are the things God said we're supposed to deny. These things right here. First Corinthians 6 and 9. Come on. You know? Unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of God. You, the Bible is going to tell you who is unrighteous. And I want to. Do you used to go to church, right? I used to. All right, follow the program of this and see if these things in the church. See if anybody in the church righteous. Watch this. Come on. That's what God said. Come on. This is the book of 1 Corinthians, chapter 6, and verse 9. Know ye not that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of God? So now we're going to know who is unrighteous. You understand? Now, Kira's grandmother, she walk with her stick. She sits in the best part of the church. Let us see if she righteous. Come on. Be not deceived, neither fornicators. Fornicator. These are the things that are unrighteous. These are unrighteous to God. You understand? In the church, brother laid up with another sister, but he's the one who walking around with collection plate. He's the one who resting his hand on you and praying for you. You understand? This, these people is not righteous. These people are unrighteous. Watch this. Come on. Be not deceived, neither fornicators, nor idolaters. Idolaters. You understand? Because everybody what goes to church have what? Around the neck. A cross. You understand? And sometimes they kiss it. Sometimes they give you the Mother Mary sign. Boop, boop, boop. You understand? These are the things what they do. These are unrighteous things. Come on. No adulterers. Now what? Hey, don't leave. Hey, yard man. Hey. I want to adjust what you just said. Don't leave. You said something. The sister up here listening. The sister ready? She want to hear what you said. Don't run. Come on. No idolaters. No effeminate. Hey, listen. Noah teach for a hundred and eighteen years before God destroyed her. That's why many people died. You said we take too long. This is the place where you supposed to be this day. You see what I'm saying? Watch this. Come on. No abuses of themselves with mankind. Who was talking about this? Yes. with me. 
mankind. Don't abuse yourself with mankind. Don't abuse yourself with mankind. Come on. No thieves. Now what? No thieves. No thieves. You understand? God said you cannot get here. Who that in the church? Church and love of God don't away me. So you can be a steal the pastor. Only one know that. As long as I bring my tithes and my offering, I'm good. I don't care if you want to, I don't care how you want to bring it here. I don't care if you want to steal it. I don't care if you want to go lay for it. Come over with it. Come on. No covetous. Okay. You know the covetous is a big thing in our neighborhood. Covet. You understand? Covet. Covet of your friend wife. Right. Covet of your friend's shoes. The bag. All these things guard. You see what I'm saying? Come on. No drunkards. Drunkards. He's not taking a drink. But he's talking about drunkards. You know some people are drink and drunk. Especially the brother them who sit the syrup. You know the syrup thing. They want to be the most high. Want to feel the molly and they want to be like yes and then yeah. making noise, but we are fighting them. When all people repent, they in captivity. Watch this, come on. Shall inherit the kingdom of God. Shall it get the kingdom of God. That's what God said. You see that? So now, my brother right here. My brother right here. Come here, come here, come here. Do you know the looks of Jesus Christ, or he look like? Give me the Isaiah 53. Read from verse 1. No, this is good. Listen, this is good. I'm gonna show you Jesus Christ. Look and tell me if he did a man that looked like Caesar Borgia. Where? At? Like what? White man Jesus. See, white man Jesus look cute. You like cute people, right? This is all my Jesus Christ look like. Bring it out. Watch this. Come on. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 53 and verse one. Who have believed our report? So who gonna believe what we say now here? Who gonna believe our report that next week when we see you repent and in French is the bad Abu? Who gonna do that? Right. Watch this, come on. And to whom is the arm of the Lord revealed? Who the arm of the Lord be revealed to be as the Israelites? We are the one with you with the arm of God revealing it. You, know, you feel that like the white people ask, oh, we know the book. 400 and something years, they tied us up and said, listen, don't read that book. But now they give us a chance in two years. And we can skip and go to the book and let you understand and bring the sense to you. Watch this, come on. For he shall grow up before him as a tender plant. So you're talking about Christ who's going to grow up before him. Who is him? God as a tender plant. Watch this, come on. And as a root out of a dry ground. Come on. He has no form nor comeliness. What is say? He has no form nor comeliness. What I mean? He has no stru structure, no appearance. No beauty. Well, beauty. Beauty. Right. beauty. He have no form nor comeliness. And when we shall see him, there is no beauty that we should desire him. You see that? So when you see, you like to look one white man Jesus, because when you pray, you still have Caesar Borgia. When you are praying, is this you having a thought? Because you said it's the first you hear about Jesus, how you look like. But God said, when you see Jesus Christ, you wasn't going to see no beauty in him. Come on, read. He is despised and rejected of men. That's why all people say, no, 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 if you look like that, no, 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 I don't want to serve him. Many of our sister pastors say, if Jesus Christ look like that, I stern and look like that, no. They want pretty looks, That's but pretty looks done. When Israel come on the scene, pretty looks done. You understand? That's right. That way. I'm telling you straight. Who want to be white man? Who, who want to be like white people? Okay. Okay. I praise this. That's why, that's why the you, that's why the white man always 
used to lock us down as a people. Whenever we start to talk about our people, they said the racist and they just lock down. No! It's a good thing you just said! You just said you are racist, that means it's a good thing, bro! You are about your race. You are about your people. Right! And that's what Israel United in Christ is all about. About our people. You know what I'm saying? Isn't God racist? Huh? Isn't God racist?
say that I'm a Jew with sound art For years I've been walking around saying that I'm a black man I ain't saying that no more, it's sound man This is Bishop Nathaniel of Israel United in Christ Please subscribe to our YouTube channels Stay up to date with our latest events, music, and classroom lessons. IUIC plans to continue visiting different countries where this gospel has not been preached before. IUIC needs your help in pushing this truth. So join us. Subscribe to our Instagram. Facebook, Twitter, and podcasts, and stay up to date with us. For more information, please visit www.israelunite.org.